Hello, so the laundry machine is on, so if you hear that in the background, that's that. Now, as we are at our workstation, with this battery, we should put away farther away from here. And we put on our gloves. Don't poke myself in the eye, these things are bendy. The safety gloves, don't really need them, not really. But we do need um, some... Uh, gloves. Was I calling the safety goggles gloves? I don't know. So, why would you need a glove for your eye? Possible reasons. Okay, so uh, here we are. We're going to remove this was soldered together yesterday. And I'll show you up close that's the soldering job that we did. And now we're going to test if this soldering job actually conducts electricity. And what we're going to do is we're going to use one of these and we're going to take a battery just to test. This is old, it's like from my teens or even earlier, my dad bought this. So we're talking like 15 years old maybe. Um, test to see if it still measures its charge and as you can see it does. Um, so we will put this battery back up here with the other batteries and we take our scissors. We unlock the safety and what we're going to do is we're going to cut this connection here and by the way this will give us an opportunity to solder again in the future um, so we want the second one I believe so, take that and strip, and we've now stripped away the uh, plastic, so it's exposed wire, the same as that is exposed wire. And of course, I am grounded, I am touching a limestone floor, or some kind of tile floor, I assume I'm grounded. I hope I'm grounded. Uh, and then we go there and go like that. Okay. Actually, we do need that battery, but so what we will be doing is Put this in around. So, okay, so we got that battery back. I'm going to put it down there. Uh, put it on the wood, I think. The wood is grounded. And we have our tape, uh, grip tape. Oof. Okay, and so we will tape, this is dangerous a little bit, it probably would only give me a bit of a buzz, but it's a 9 volt battery. There we go. And now, I'm scared of doing this. Whoa, okay, it definitely has a charge. Now we will test to see if this is still charged.
doesn't seem to have a charge. This has no charge. So I'll put these in the helping hands. My eyesight's not that great without my glasses. There we go. And close that. And it looks like every. I'm sure the clock radio would have burnt out. Clock radio. That would have burnt out if. Uh, if there was still a charge, I hope. I hope everything is safe. And there's also a battery here, so I got a large battery.